Well, there's this Will Ferrell movie called Semi-Pro. Jackie Moon, the guy right there, his character wrestles a bear to entertain the team's fans. Okay, we can't promise bears for the Nebraska Strikers, but they are semi-pro, one of the 40 teams that make up the Women's Blue Chip Basketball League. Yeah, Risha Bristol is the owner. Mm -hmm. She's also a player, and her teammates, uh, Michaela K.K. Hauser and Yvonne Turner, they're here as, as right. well this morning. Good it's to nice to have you. you two here for the first time. We've mm -hmm. had you on the show before talking about your work with kids in the area, so good to have you back. Thank well, you. This is Looking fun. And you guys all have, uh, I mean, you all played college ball. Mm -hmm. uh, I think, what, Arizona? Uh, Purdue and, and played in Nebraska, right? Yes. And you're from awesome. the area. Yeah. So I this is cool. This. Explain the frame up this league for us, this, the, your team. Okay, so our team is part of the WBCBL, which is the Women's Blue Chip Basketball League. Um, there's over 40 teams across the United States, and we represent the Midwest region. You started in 2014. Yes. Why? What did you do? What did you want to do with it? I wanted to give women the opportunity to further their career. Mm -hmm. um, there's a lot of women that either were pregnant in high school and never had a chance to go to college or um, their college career ended mm -hmm. their last game and didn't get to play but pro. They still want to play yeah. ball, yeah. right? They still love the game. They still want to be part of it. So it's like, well, okay, now what, what can we do for them? And then for the fans who still want to watch you play. Yes, and we have the Creighton and the Nebraska uh -huh. uh, women's teams, and then you now have the Nebraska Strikers for families and children to come and enjoy the excitement. Yeah, you bring up a good point because, well, I'm a musician, and after high school and college, I played, um, I could still play. As a musician, you can keep playing until you get old, you know, whatever. <laughs> but as athletes, you know, at some point, there's a time to hang it up, but you guys aren't ready. I mean, because you're still young, yeah. so I think the concept of the league is great. Who is eligible to play? Do you have to be a, a former college player or just high school player? You just have to love the game of basketball, really. Mm -hmm. But also, there's a, an age limit. You have to be above the age of 20, 20 or older, mm -hmm. older and uh, not have any eligibility left mm -hmm. for uh -huh. athletics. Well, sense, yeah. And Or you can be an NAIA player. So because we're not paid, we're all volunteers. You're volunteers, which and so are the coaches. I mean, you're, are you a coach or are you just a player? I am a general owner. manager. Well, she, I know she's <laughs> what isn't she? But, <laughs> really, but you, you talk about being volunteers, which Michaela speaks to the heart for me. Your heart has to be in this because it's not like you're making millions of dollars when you put on that uniform. Yeah. So what, what does it mean to you? Right. Um, you know, like Risha said, it's just a bunch of us who love the game of basketball, love to play. Um, we all have a similar mindset and goal. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of moms um, working full time. Um, so it's something that we do on the side, but something that keeps us going every day. How about the next game? Can we talk about your schedule, Yvonne? Maybe you could you could break that down for us. When do you guys play next? Yes. Um, we play July 9th um, against Archangels um, at St. Mary's. Yep. Uh -huh. Yes. Oh, uh, Missouri. From yeah. Missouri. Yes. Like right away, this isn't yeah. about the big Oh, okay. <laughs> Definitely not. Um, but we play July 9th against Archangels mm -hmm. at Saints College of St. Mary's at 9 uh -huh. or 7. 7. That's your next home PM. game. So if yes. viewers want to see you play in person, that's uh, July 9th. That'll be your next shot at it. Do you have any like any rivalries? I mean, a lot of you all did in college. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. So now that you're part of this league with 40 teams, are there any teams that sort of stand out where you're like, we've got their number, or we want it, we really want to beat them? Yes. Well, for the most part. Uh, is St. Louis Surge. Mm -hmm. They've been the national champions. Uh, their rings are so big. The diamond. <laughs> <laughs> the ring is so big. Um, but they've been the national champions and um, they always beat us. Mm -hmm. But this year at the beginning of the season, we beat them. I saw that so, online. Yeah. yeah, so that was very exciting for us and bittersweet, you know. Um, but now there's an Iowa team. Mm -hmm. So I think that's going to be our biggest rival just because the it's proximity. Iowa. Yeah. Yeah. So how, are you, how are you doing right now? Where are we at in the league? How, how uh, we right now we're tied for third. Mm -hmm. So we are 3 and 1. Um, we just lost on Saturday no. to another St. Louis <laughs> team. Right. And, um, That'd be the last time that happens. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're not, right. We see them again at their happens. place in Missouri. Um, so. But the, people can come, come watch the games. Tickets are available and sponsorship opportunities. If you're a business, you want to help the league out mm -hmm. and sponsor uh, a little bit. How, how do people do that? I mean, just go to our website, NebraskaStrikersWBB.com. Mm -hmm. You're um, on the Facebook. Yeah, and Facebook, the Twitter. And the right. Twitter. <laughs> and Everything. Everything. Yeah. Instagram. And Instagram. And everywhere. Mm -hmm. But no, I think that speaks to your, your presence. You're all in on this. Mm -hmm. And so for, for fans, if you're watching now, this may, f I'm thinking about a couple of people who say, yes, I know this team exists and I want to go watch them play. Um, or, N what? This team is in the Omaha? Yes. So if you want to go watch high caliber ball, um, 
Nebraska Strikers. It's where it's at. There's all the information if you want to connect with the ladies, um, both in season and out. They do all kinds of stuff. Yep. Thank you for being nice here. Coming in. Nice to have yes. you back. Thank you. Thank you. going down, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Mike's ready to talk some trash today. <laughs> Bring him in to get you fired and up. And we average yeah. 93 points a game. So what? we're actually wow. getting up and down the court. Right. We're yeah. ready Jeez, to go. Girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's fabulous. Yeah. I love so. that. All right, lobster rolls are a summer staple.